Hey everybody, what's up? Floyd Landis. Ah, Floyd. Floyd Floyd. Here's the story with old Floyd, this guy. Floyd Landis recently came out and admitted that he used performance enhancing drugs throughout most of his career. This comes after he denied over and over again ever having any involvement whatsoever. This guy is an absolute beauty. He won the 2006 Tour de France but had that title stripped because of a doping offense. He was suspended for two years on top of that. This guy spent years fighting this, proclaiming his innocence. He spent $2 million in court fees trying to prove his innocence. He was on TV shows, morning shows, in front of cameras. I'm innocent. I didn't do it. Only to eventually turn around and say, uh, yeah, I did do it. This drives me crazy. I can't stand it when athletes like Floyd Landis, like Mark McGuire, like Marion Jones, the list goes on and on, unfortunately, when they lie and deny over and over again ever having any involvement with performance enhancing drugs. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. I did not do this. Only to turn around and say, uh, yeah, I did do it. I used the whole time. It drives me crazy. It's one thing to cheat. It's another thing to lie on top of cheating. It's just ridiculous. But this isn't the end of the story with Floyd Landis. Oh no, it gets slimier. This guy implicated other athletes. He sent emails to cycling and anti-doping officials implicating other athletes, including Lance Armstrong. He says that Lance Armstrong's coach introduced him to performance enhancing drugs. He also said that Lance Armstrong helped him learn how performance enhancing drugs are taken. He says he doesn't have any proof, so you'll just have to believe him. This is coming from Floyd Landis, so I'm not going to automatically believe that Lance Armstrong is guilty, but unfortunately in this day and age, where there's smoke, there's normally performance enhancing fire. That's just normally how it goes. But this is the larger issue. When you have guys like Barry Bonds, Roger Clemens, Lance Armstrong, even Brian Cushing, when they come out and say, I didn't do it, I'm innocent, it's a lot harder to buy their stories when you got guys like Floyd Landis pulling a switcheroo like this. I'm Brian No, and that's a no-brainer.